Rowan's influence. She's uh, going to run. So, hello, welcome to the vlog. It's a Saturday morning. Oh, Rowan's just seen some geese. They're huge. So, yeah, today is a um, charity run in Yaitza for an organisation called Vodapad Lubavi. So, Vodapad Lubavi is an organisation that gives help to children with additional needs here in Yaitza. And this run today is a charity run to raise money for them for the work that they're doing. And so, we're out putting up way markers. So yeah, like Matt said, the run is to raise money for uh, this organisation, Vodapad uh, Yubavi, and we're raising money um, so that the children can go to um, a special sensory room. It's something that really helps these kids, and but it costs a lot of money to do that here in Bosnia-Herzegovina, and so this group of mums who started this organisation, um, yeah, they want to be able to take the kids to the sensory room, so we're raising money to help them do that. But this is also like a virtual race, so people from other countries, other towns in Bosnia-Herzegovina have also signed up to race. So they're going to be running during this weekend wherever they live and they'll be sending in their results, how far they ran, how fast they ran. Today at 11 o'clock, everyone who's signed up, who's actually from Yaitsen, is going to meet in the town centre. We're going to have a short, like, fun music programme and then people are going to start. They can either walk or run however far they want to. Um, and then they come back to the centre of town when they've done however far they want to go and they'll get a medal. So everyone who's signed up and who's paid to be part of the race gets a medal and all the money that they've paid to be part of the race goes towards this organisation and the work that they're doing. There we go. If you wanted to run six kilometres, obviously you'd run out to here and then run back to town. So we've put up signs for one, two, two and a half, three, four and five kilometres and hopefully that helps people. If anyone wants to do less than that, they can make up their own mind where they turn around. Um, so yeah, the last one is almost as far as the mills out here in Yaitza. And um, yeah, it's time for us to head back and uh, meet up with everyone else, load stuff into the van and head into town and set up. So after a bit of a run around, we've loaded in everything, well loaded in, loaded out. Everything's out the combi and dotted around here and now it's time to plug it all in, get everything up and running. We've got half an hour, we've got 27 minutes. Let's go. So if the boss doesn't mind his song being on YouTube, you'll get a little bit of what's going on here. EA is up and running. I need to do a mic check. The people are gathered here. Him and a glass for a setup ready to go. And yeah, we've got seven minutes till it all kicks off. Let's test the mic. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Ciao. <laughs> Hi. When you run. Come back, find me, we talk on the vlog, yeah? Okay. okay. <laughs> That's Rowan's influence. She's uh, going to run. Hey! Hey! 
Yeah. So the first people have started to come back into town. Um, yeah, medals are being handed out and a road is responsible for that shares the list. So I am sort of the DJ for this event. I say sort of the DJ because when you've just got a playlist going on your laptop, you're not really DJing. Um, but I guess I'm curate, curator of the playlist. How was it? You both just ran. Do you like your medal that you got? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. Uh, yeah. It has a lot of colors, and I love these colors. It's uh, like lion, but it's our town too. So uh, half lion and half yate. So it was your first race that you've yes. done. Yes. Will you do another race? Yes, uh, I'm proud of this race. Maybe next time I would uh, run a little bit more yeah. than just two. Excellent. Congratulations to both thank of you. Thank you. Thank you. So as we get towards the end of the program here, it's time to say a huge thank you to everyone who's run here in Yaitse today. A big thank you to everyone who's taken part in who took Lubavi online, kind of somewhere else in the world, and donated and supported and helped raise loads of money uh, for Budapad Lubavi, the organisation here in Yaitse. It's going to make a big difference to the young people whose lives are involved in that. And so, uh, yeah, it's been a good morning. It is one o'clock on the dot, which is when we said we were finishing off. We might be waiting for one person who's gone out to come back and collect their medal. But it is time to sort of wrap down the program and start packing stuff down. Go on. So that is it for this week's vlog. Thanks very much for watching. Do give us a big thumbs up for Turka Lubavi and for being in town and uh, yeah, doing what we've done today. Do remember that together we do adventure. We'll see you next time. <laughs>